y'all. Y'all should be saying something about another video. Y'all stay on here with my brother. Yo, Coons. No, nah, my name question though. Rich. Anyways, I'm here to ask him. I'm here to ask my brother an uncomfortable question. You're afraid to ask other boys. So, Christian, I'm going to ask you questions. Better not be nothing and, crazy, man. Well, you agreed to do this video and. We about to get into this. Before we get into this video, make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my solo channel. It's Tay Say Boop. And make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe so you guys don't know when I post another video. Period. Okay, you want to give me any any social media things? Nah, they don't okay. need it. Don't nobody watching your videos, man. Uh, don't do too much. I get views. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Okay. Why he cool? Like, why he got on so Boy, that bright-ass light, man. Okay, Aiden. All right, come on, now. Before I start feeling myself, man. Boy. Anyways, okay. First question. We're going to start off easy. Who was your favorite sibling? Uh... Michael. Me. It should be me because... Michael. Michael don't even talk to you. Okay. Every time you come on and I say, hey, Christian, and your dumb ass on his feet beat. But Michael's there when I need him. <sighs> Whatever. Okay. Have you ever bought a plan B for a girl? Nope. You know about a plan B. You know what a plan B is. Mm -hmm. He 22. He 22, y'all. So he, he old enough to know what I'm talking about. Okay. Y'all better strap up on him now. Oh, my God. So, does it matter how many guys or girls a girl has been with before you? Uh... Like, nah. if a girl been like, oh, I've been with 10 guys and she's 20 years old, like. Oh, nah. That thing, oh. <laughs> nah, she dirty, bro. Nah. She dirty? Nah. Oh, my God. So, ten. ladies, if you got over 10 bodies, that's the number for my bro. Uh, we, um, I mean, it's all right. It depends on who you are. You just sleep with guys, no. You, you, if you have relationships with them, I can understand. But uh, you might be the problem. Have you and one of your other friends, like one of your guy friends, have y'all ever shared a girl? No, hell no. Why are you lying? Y'all had to dig on Will. Hell no. Don't roll like that, man. What's mine is mine, man. No. So how y'all done it and you didn't know y'all were talking to the same girl? No, we ain't never do that, man. We won't roll like that, man. Do you think girls be tripping when they on their period? Mm, a little bit. I ain't gonna say nothing else. How long does how long does it take you to get comfortable with a girl? I say about a month, a month, a, a, a month, month, a month or two. I don't know about it. Maybe you almost about it. It's six months to a year. I don't know you like that. A month. I guess so. Okay, so what do you guys do when a girl stinks? Stink with hell. Is she like fishy, musty, musty? Like, wh what would you tell her? Like, I mean, what would you, what do you do? Like, <laughs> you mean that alone? <laughs> yeah, it's like, let's say you about to eat hot oh, or something. Man. Or like, <laughs> we just quit. <laughs> what? Answer the question, like, oh. was, okay. Let's say you want a girl about to have sex, whatever. And you about to go eat her out, and she fishy down there. What you, you uh, gonna just get up and be like, bitch, you sign? Like, what you gonna do? Bro, we just getting up and going, man. We ain't saying nothing. What you mean you're not gonna say nothing? She gonna ask why? Like, what you gonna say? Bro. We just getting up and going. 
own bar. So you just gonna get up and not say nothing at all? I heard about some green stuff coming out some girl, bro. Oh know. my god. Nah. One of your friends saw you there or you experienced it yourself? Tell my huh? You Hell no, I experienced that. But say he saw that green stuff coming out and he went outside and hopped on his bike <laughs> and his drawers, man. I was like, oh Lord. Oh my god. Would you ever get a girl's name tattooed on you? No. I feel like you lying. I feel like you were sad, so I feel like you would egg on um, like when you fall in love with a girl, I feel like y'all gonna I feel like you gonna do it. I feel like you gonna be the one to do something like this. You or Donald. No, not Donald. You or Mike no. I feel it's gonna be you. I think it's gonna be you. And you crazy. <sighs> Do you watch porn? If so, what category? Then you all. <laughs> Wait! Hey, this is what you want to know. It's a yes or no question. Uh, you a boy, so we know you do. So. <laughs> they don't got know all that. It's a yes or no question. Man, oh. Uh, you could say past 10, and nobody's saying you watching it now, like. Everybody's seen porn before. Uh, Ain't nobody asking, do you still watch it? It's like, you, you gotta just skip that question, man. You scared if you grow, who go there and go check you? Oh. Ain't a grown, ain't I? What are you asking me to go? <laughs> oh my God, see, he agreed to watch you to do this video, y'all. He wanna add different. Now, like, I told you this is gonna be awkward questions. So, uh, what category? Uh, yeah, but I ain't saying what category. You ain't put me on like that, man. Uh. <laughs> oh, my God. Do you wipe after you pee? Do you? Use I will hope the fuck so? Who the fuck wipes after they pee? Girls do it, and most guys do it because why would you, you can get pee on your underwear? You can get pee, do you jump on your legs or like that. That's nasty. Like, who wipes after they pee? Why would you not wipe after you pee? That don't make no sense. Are you dirty? <laughs> that don't make no sense. What you mean? Hey, <laughs> CJ. Mm. So you saying after you pee, you just jiggle it and just put it back in your pants? I mean, you know that's how you get um UTIs, right? Bro, you don't gotta wipe after you pee. Thank you, please. Okay. D I R C motherfucker. Um, you need to go to the doctor. Cause that's how you get UTIs. So if you wonder why you got bumps and you itching. You don't gotta wipe after you pee. Don't listen to them. That is how you get a UTI infection. All right, next question. I'll look it up later. When was the last time you had sex? Huh? Uh, either 20, uh, a year ago or two. Oh, so you been left hand, right hand. No, I'm playing. I was laying. Um, do you get just, okay, when the last time you been in a relationship then? Two years ago? Didn't know the Greek girl came here. Um, a serious one? Uh, high school? So, like, was you, like, jealous? Did it come to certain things? Like, mm-hmm. No, you got You seem the wrong like you got, you get How jealous. did you handle your relationship when it came to certain things? It, it, how did you set your boundaries? Uh, there wasn't really no boundaries. I mean... So that mean you want to What was her name? We was on, uh, uh. Oh. <laughs> it was up with an A, didn't it? We ain't doing you all that. that. You talking about that flat chested girl that you were telling me about one time. She we ain't like, doing all that. <laughs> I got to edit it out, this time. <laughs> no, no, we ain't doing all that next question. You eat ass. Hell no. You ain't no real freak. Don't start talking about stuff. Does height matter to you? No. So you'll date a girl taller than you? No. 
How yeah, tall are uh, you? You like it depends. I'm five eight. Know. You got to be like six foot. Five eleven. Five eleven. Mm-hmm. What are you planning on doing on in the next year? Huh? What do you plan on doing with your life in the next year? Uh, I don't know. Whatever. No, like, yeah. Nah. <laughs> Would you let your girl have guy friends? Mm-hmm. To what certain extent? Ain't nothing wrong having guy friends. But I'm saying, as like, long as she it, can sit there and be trusted. That's why I said, what type of boundaries do you set in a relationship? Because if you letting your girl have guy friends and they try to come on to her, but you don't know about it, and she feeds into it, and she been friends with him longer than you no, know, she been with friends longer. With him, that she been with you, how mm-hmm. do you take it? I mean, as long as she's spending more time with them than me. I mean. So, if she's spending more time with her guy, her guy friend, do you see a problem with it? No. They were together before we met, right? It doesn't matter. See that? You sound about together. I'm talking about you and your girlfriend. Y'all been going on, giving That's a relationship. Even though she got guy friends before you came... Mm-hmm. Y'all together now. Why would you? Why would you want her spending more time with your her friend, guy friends and you? You want to think something going on? I said as long as they ain't, she ain't spending more time with them than me. That's what I was saying. So okay, so that's like what said. because some guys they'll be like, I, like, cause this video is for like you answer questions for like all boys because mm-hmm. like I said, some people get to ask like their brothers or boyfriend these type of questions. So like. You the type to be like, okay, you can have... Okay, how many guy friends can she have? One or two. Okay, like, does it matter, like, if they... How long they have been friends for you to, like, set them around? Before we met. Okay, so, like, let's say she was like, oh, this is my friend. We've been friends for two weeks, and y'all just got together. You want because most guys' friend, I mean, most guys see that they gonna they gonna I know they that. want they gonna get in that girl' pants. Is it, well, most most. I okay, that. I'm gonna say it like this because I've okay, been so like you gotta like my ex boyfriend had boundaries. So like, even though I had my best friend, if I had a guy friend, he didn't take it. He didn't like it because he felt like if I'm hanging with this dude all the time, no, what what he, what the hell are you doing with me? You spending more time with. Him, then you spending more time with me. I see something wrong with me. And he think I'm trying to build a whole other relationship. Or he think I'm doing something sneaky. So you want to think otherwise that your girlfriend doing something behind your back? Overnight. And they together overnight. What the hell? She could be doing something dirty damn way. We went to damn kids being the girl was sucking her nigga dick in the damn car. Kids out of playing the damn car. I'm leaving. <laughs> so that don't mean she. Like, you just got to think girl's, about it because. Girl's going to cheat, man. Guys gonna cheat Guys too. Cheat. Cause gonna you gotta cheat, understand, man. like, caught watching this TikTok and the guy was pretending to be this girlfriend and her boyfriend was suspicious because every time she would live out of the car, he'd be like, yo, your girl find stuff like that. Like, most guys are gonna be like, I wanna be her friend because she wanna see what the hell, what the hell y'all going on so they can see if y'all break up and she'll go on to him, lean on to him. So, how, okay, so. If you were to how many girls' friends would you expect your girlfriend wants you to have? None. So how's no, it no, fair? No. How's it would fair you let your you man go? have a girl best friend? Or a girl as a friend? I'm going to answer this because I can answer it. I had a boyfriend. He had a girl as a friend. But I felt like he was always doing something because he was always at his her house and he was hanging over there all the time. His friends and his cousins would be over there. I, I really seen a fucking problem with it. Your brother even clearly seen a problem with it. I was just like, I don't feel comfortable with you sitting over there all the fucking time because you putting more time over there than you spending time with me. And I don't like that. Mm-hmm. So I was assuming that he was sleeping around with her. And I just seen that toothless looking ass bitch. <laughs> oh, egg my ass home. So do you have, do you choose, like, do you have a favorite parent? Mama Cruz, if you watch the video, you know what I'm saying? It better be Mama Cruz. Uh, yeah. Mama? Okay, <laughs> last question. 
Who do you let sit in the front seat? Your girlfriend or your mother? Y'all both get the fuck in the back seat. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't finna sit up and argue. I say it don't matter. It don't matter. So if you would you expect your girlfriend to get in the back seat unless your mama get chicken in the front wing, seat? Chicken wing, chicken wing. Um, I, I wouldn't. I don't care about that. You probably answer for the guys out there like uh, us guys don't care sitting in the front seat, or back seat. Some guys would be like, "Hey, girl, get get in the back seat." Or if it was between my mother, my child, my grandmother, oh y'all can get in the back seat. Y'all don't give a fuck. Man. If I had to choose, um, Mama, put you back in that front seat. <laughs> if I had to choose, um, Mama, first thing about that, she wouldn't. I'm driving my own damn car. My mom can be in the passenger and she can sit in the back. Y'all hear it here, guys. My girlfriend. But y'all, Christian answered the best he could, she know. Without putting my baby. I know some of y'all guys gonna have different opinions, stuff like that, the way Christian answered the questions. I answered the full We can talk about <laughs> we can just talk about in the comments, Shell. What you guys think? Yeah, That's what you guys think, Shell. Mm -hmm. um, I'm back. I'm a fellow fucking chicken bowl, bitch. <laughs> Don't do too much. Man, I thought you were gonna ask me, um, do I spray my cheeks in the shower? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a bit of my awkward questions, but damn, I ain't gonna get that fucking awkward. Why would I fucking ask if you? What the fuck you gonna do? Bend over? So who doing the bend? This ain't jail cell number 43. What's going all right, on? All right, so I got one question before we go. I'm asking you questions. You okay. don't ask me questions. Since I'm not sitting beside you no more. I don't know what the fuck you on. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys love up my social channel. It's take say boo. And you should want to get on your social media. Um, to them females out there, it's um none of your business. My channel coming stupid soon, y'all. It's gonna be called the Hoe of the Ass Verb. You know what? <laughs> Don't touch the point. If you put grease on my head, I'm gonna get your ass beat. They're gonna call you chicken wing, ho. Alright, y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one.